Alright guys, so it is time for the weekly PSA. I'm, I know I'm a little bit late. I like to do it on Wednesdays because I like to call it the weekly grind Wednesdays. But what can you do? Um, I was unable to do it because yesterday I wanted to showcase my extreme physical team. Now, it's technically September 28th th on Thursday, the day that I actually put this up. Um, or the day that I put up that video with the extreme team. And I didn't really get a lot of requests for the teams. I did do a showcase at the end of my video of all my 100% uh, cards. And I have a full 100% hero team. That includes the Goku Jr. So I don't know if you actually want to consider that 100%. But he is technically a hero and he is 100% it. And then I have like uh, five hundred percent villains with like my Omega Shenron at 95 96 percent right now so if you guys have any requests let me know I will not be home this weekend for Friday Saturday Sunday um, technically Friday I will be home it, because I'm going to be uh, that's the day I'm leaving up, up for Rochester New York to go visit a buddy for his bachelor party um, so I want to be up there for the entire weekend. I know second weekend in a row, if you've been following me, I had a stag party last weekend too. So, <laughs> you know, a lot of stuff going on. Uh, but yeah, it's actually Wednesday night, Thursday morning. Um, so Wednesday would have actually been the day that I released the extreme physical team against Kid Buu. Um, I'm taking a request for what you want to see me go up against the Kid Buu event with. Um, my standard just that I've been using is just the strength event, uh, the strength team. Um, just because it's easier to beat the event with that. But um, I'm probably going to try it out with my uh, Mono Technique team with a double Gotenks lead. Just because I have a lot of 100% of tech characters. But without further ado, let's go ahead and talk about the stuff you guys probably came here to actually watch. Or listen to because you want to know what's going on. So uh, first off, the Heroes Legacy event, the one you see on the screen right now for the Goku Jr. As of today, that has ended, at least the day that the video is going up. That ends on 9.27 at 10.59 p.m. PST. So it actually, from the time that I'm actually recording, it's a couple hours, hour and a half. But um, this is going to be over, so you will no longer be able to grind this out until it comes back out again. Um, I got my second one up to Super Attack 7. I just grind it out every once in a while, so that way I can get a Super Attack up. Not a big deal. I don't really need the base form, but I have the main, the main guy I want it done. Uh, so that's over. No longer going to be available. Uh, the next one is the Warrior of Universe 6 Banner and event that is with the kale and califla uh this is going to be over in 10 at uh, 10 3 which is next tuesday so that's how long you have until summon on that banner and to go up and get the medals from that event that you need um, next one is the super 17 also runs until 10 3 that's both the event and the gotcha so that way you if you want to pull on this banner i tried my luck i got a super saiyan 4 vegeta so i'm not upset about that because i only had one dupe path now i have two but um, if you know, I didn't get any of these guys um, of the new units. I'm not too upset because I did pull Majin Vegeta a couple weeks ago. I think about a month ago. So in terms of mono extreme agility, I'm kind of set there. I don't need Super 17, but the other two SSRs would be nice. But they'll be available in the future. Um, the next one is going to be the Genius Bulma Battle Prep. That is available till 10-9. Now, if you guys don't know and you're new, typically when the event ends, that is when we get a world tournament. So that means, or well, usually around the time that ends, we get the world tournament. Um, 10 9 it actually happens to be a Monday. I don't think the World Tournament is going to start on a Monday. I kind of hope it's not this coming weekend. Uh, we'll find out. We'll see what happens when the actual tournament is going to be. Typically, they do it on a Thursday or a Friday is when they start. Um, but uh, yeah, we'll be looking for this probably on that week, the weekend right before 10 9. So I could see this running on like on maybe 10 6, October 5th or 6th at the starting. So make sure you guys are ready for the World Tournament. The card that they're going to be giving us, it's supposed to be the Super Saiyan Gohan, and he is a real good leader he is not a leader good support unit he is really good support for a hero team and he's really good support for a mono hero strength team so keep that in mind guys he's he's going to be a really good viable unit he's also really good for the future uh, gohan event that will the gohan event gohan card that comes out the one with the category lead for half saiyan he's gonna be really good on that as well um so the next one is the Autumn Harvest login bonus event that's still running. Make sure you log in every day. That's going to run until 10-9 as well. And that's when we're probably going to start a new login bonus thing that goes on. So make sure you're logging in to get all those rewards. Even if you don't play, that's probably something you would want to do. I do recommend at least doing three levels. That way you get all the additional potential orbs that are in the special missions. So essentially you want to train uh, with an item. You want to train with a location um, to, get, to do a little bit of a level up right there. And then you want to purchase something from the Baba Shop and you want to beat three levels. That's how you're going to get all those uh, extra uh, potential orbs from the special events. Uh, make sure, or the special mission rewards. Make sure you do that. 
Uh, last but not least, well, not last but not least, uh, Lone Warriors Last Battle. That runs until 10.10, Tuesday 10.10. So we have a while for that one. So if you want to go ahead and grind that out, I mean, it's nothing really that, you know, that you're going to need to do or would, like, really actually want to do. But you could do it. Go ahead and grab that. It runs for another about two, yeah, about a week and a half, I would say. Um, you're going to want that, actually, for the medals to Doken Awaken your Great Apes if you have them. But outside of that, really, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, make sure you grab all the medals for all the Doken Awakenings, because even though that they, some of these guys don't have Dokens yet, they will in the future. Um, so, and last but not least, we have the Kid Buu event. That just started a couple, about four days ago, guys. We have a while for that. It's going to run until about 10.15. Um, which is what? So 28th. So we have a full, almost a full, well, two and a half weeks left before that Kid Boo event ends. So global side, we really just have um, the ones that are ending soon are going to be the Warriors of Universe 6 and Super 17. So make sure you utilize those while you can. And then we have some time um, for the other two that are out. So Lone Warriors Last Battle and Kid Boo event. And just, you know, whatever. The Genius Ball, ball in the Battle Prep. That's really good if you don't have good support items. You know, do it. If not, I mean... Baba Shop is your best friend for that too. I usually Baba Shop ever get everything from the Baba Shop, and I have almost a thousand of the like really standard items that you use all the time. And like the Icaruses and stuff like that, I have about like two to three hundred of those. Um, so make sure you go in there too to help get, help yourself out. Now, next we're gonna be talking about the JP side. Now, the game is currently in maintenance, so I couldn't find all the events. I did go through the uh, JP uh, Japan.dbc.space like I typically do, but I usually go in game to make sure I cover everything. So if I'm missing anything here, guys, let me know. Um, I also didn't do this in order in terms of when the event ends because um, there's too much stuff going on over here anyway. Um, so the first thing is we have the future event coming out, the Angel Frieza from Dragon Ball Super. Really looking forward to that. Um, I just want to see what happens. Um, I'll be watching videos. I don't really do the new stuff on the JP side a lot. I usually wait for really good events, so that way I get my guaranteed SSRs just because I'm a free-to-play on that side. Um, but yeah, um, really cool. Um, it's going to be a good event. I really can't wait for that to happen. So that's going to be coming out soon. There's nothing official out yet, but it does say coming soon. Um, the next is going to be the Tournament of Survival Summons. At least that's what we're calling it. Um, so the Tournament of Survival is uh, summons are here. That's going to run until 10-11, so October 11th. We have some time for that. If you want to go in, there's a whole bunch of new cards. I went and did an in-depth review when they first came out. I didn't do a review after all the official translations came out, so I apologize about that. I'll have to get on that at some point. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to do that this weekend. And if, honestly, if it goes past this weekend, I probably won't be able to do it. I'll probably do it when, the, when it comes out to the global side. But these are all pretty cool units, and the Topo, I'm pretty sure, was a super leader, um, like a mini super leader, so he's really cool. I just really stoked about that Super 7, or that's uh, Android 17, because I like Android 7. Um, next is going to be the same thing, the Tournament of Survival event. Um, that's here, so make sure you go ahead and grind that out to get a new item. I don't know what that item does, because I just found out about it. Um, I'll have to figure that out. It looks like it's meant to get you some um, stuff from the Baba Shop, so that's pretty damn cool. All right, um, so we'll go ahead and grind that out if you want to. That will and that ends like that ends next month. We have a full month left of that event. 1024. Next one, Monster Rabbit event. Uh, not a big event that you actually would need to or want to run. That's how you Doken Awaken your Bulmas. So if you want to Doken Awaken those Bulmas, go ahead and do that. That's also where you get your Monster Rabbit. That runs until 1003. Uh, the next is going to be the Gratitude of Adventure or the Adventure of Gratitude event. And that runs until 1003. That's where you get the Goku and he Doken Awakens into uh, you know peace sign because it's the one year anniversary, two year anniversary. So the three-year anniversary is going to be coming up, guys. So I don't know what they're going to do. It's going to be cool for the JP side. Um, but yeah, that goes until 10-3. Uh, next is going to be the retweet campaign. Now, I haven't really covered this on mine. Uh, I mean, it's on my channel. So I haven't really done anything with it. But um, essentially, oh, I didn't put that up. So the retweet campaign runs until 10-07. So I guess follow the uh, the official tweet uh, Twitter of Dokkan Battle and do the retweets. Uh, World Tournament Mission Reward Collection and Summons run until 10.03. That's what this is over here. So make sure you go and collect those rewards and summon with the tickets that you have if you plan on doing so. The We have an... Oh, well, that's not here right now. There is an Orb Change banner apparently available right now on the JP side with all the Orb Changers. So make sure you go ahead and summon on that if you would, if you need some Orb Changers. Um, 10, million uh, 10 billion Power Warriors event. That's the cooler event, the Korra event. That is going to that is out. It's just those stupid cores that are there. It's not really anything major. It's on the JP side, so if you don't have it, go ahead and check it out. Uh, there's nothing really there. The, the actual farmable characters really suck, so it's just more of a grind for Dragonstones. And then last but not least is the Dokkan campaign, is what you actually see on your screen here. I forgot to open up the tabs for the uh, for the other uh, things that I just mentioned. The Dokkan com campaign, essentially, every day, for every couple days, there is a new Dokkan event that actually goes through, and it's like 
physical for a couple days, and then you have, um, you know, uh, extreme uh, strength, uh, you know, heroes of heroes and extreme team. Uh, the intelligence, I believe right now it is the um, uh, technique, I believe, right? It's a 10, yeah, 10-3, 10, 10 20, 9, 26. Um, anyway, so, you know, you can go ahead and summon on those banners and you have a whole bunch of other stuff. It looks like we have the Bio Broly event uh, until 9-29. That's probably ending tomorrow, today. Today is the day that the event, yeah. It's, it's probably ending today if it hasn't already ended. So, you know, go ahead and take advantage of it while you still can. I still do my daily login rewards. But anyway, guys, um, I know we're hitting, we just hit the 10 minute mark. I actually covered everything I wanted to cover. Go ahead, take advantage of everything. Here you go. I'm throwing up on the screen right now. This is the list of everything that you would want to worry about. You can go ahead and pause it if you want to. That way you can take note of everything that's going on. Um, if I miss anything on the JP side, again, I'm sorry. The game's under, under maintenance, so I just went off of uh, the dbz.space for all that information. But thank you for joining me here today. Hope that was helpful to you guys. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you're new here, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.